I believe that this nation should commit itself to achieving the goal before this decade is out of landing a man on the moon and returning him safely to the Earth. never come again. But why some say the moon? Why choose this as our goal? And they may well ask, why climb the highest mountain? Why 35 years ago, fly the Atlantic? Why does Rice play Texas? We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other thing. Not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Because that challenge is one that we're willing to accept, one we are unwilling to postpone, and one we intend to win, and the others too. Marshall Space Flight Center had spent years directing development and testing of the Saturn 1B launch vehicle, and it was not by chance that Apollo 7 was placed almost exactly on its planned trajectory into orbit about the Earth. 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9. We have ignition sequence start. The engines are armed. 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. We have commit. We have... We have liftoff. Liftoff at 7.51 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Minus 15 seconds. Guidance is internal. 12, 11, 10, 9. Ignition sequence start. 6. surface of the moon. On this July 20th, 1969. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Okay, yes, we've had a problem here. Five guys. Go, guys. We've had a hard one. I don't know what it was. Okay. Oh, Houston, we've had a problem. We've had a main bus thunderbolt. See an AC bus thunderbolt there, guys? Or, uh, ECOM? Negative flight. Believe the crew reported. We got a main bus. Houston, we've had a problem. Houston, we've
minus 15 seconds. The voice of launch control, Hugh Harris of NASA. T-minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. We have main engine start. 4, 3, 2, 1, and liftoff. Liftoff on the 25th Space Shuttle mission, and it has cleared the tower. Challenger going That's planned. since the old Apollo days in the Skylab missions. It's chilly in Florida. Icicles formed on the pad overnight. NASA engineers are concerned that they might have broken off during the launch and affected the fragile heat protection tiles. It's always amazing to hear how quickly the shuttle moves. It's already more than four miles downwind. It's throttling up three inches now at 104%. Challenger, go and throttle up. Go and throttle up. Go and throttle up. The shuttle mission will launch my God. One minute 15. There's been an explosion. Velocity 2,900 feet per second, altitude 9 nautical miles, downrange distance 7 nautical miles. This is not standard. This is not something that is planned, of course. I can see a solid rocket booster has broken away from Shuttle Challenger. That's what you're looking at in the middle of your screen. I cannot see the shuttle itself. I don't know if it's able to continue on one rocket booster. If it's able to jettison that rocket booster, it will be able to return to the Kennedy Space Center, perhaps the shuttle engines are not enough to power the shuttle back down. Flight and controllers are looking very carefully at the situation. Obviously a major malfunction. I hope they were able to survive. I hope the We have no downlink. We have absolutely no sign at all of the shuttle itself. All we saw was that one explosion only about a minute into the flight and we saw the solid rocket booster now here's something coming down i don't know what that is i don't think that that's the shuttle i believe that's a piece of debris that's coming back earthbound Max. Uh, flight Max, Gotcha. Also. One minute to go, flight. Columbia, Houston, UHF, com check. I'm glad you see no C-bands yet. Flight intel. Go. I could swap the strings in the blind. Okay. Command is over. Don't work, flight. GC flight. GC flight. Why do you say block the doors? Copy.
to go to the moon in this decade and do the other thing. Not because they are easy, but because they are hard. The final liftoff of Atlantis on the shoulders of the space shuttle. America will continue the dream. Roger roll, Atlantis. Houston now controlling the flight of Atlantis. The space shuttle spreads its wings one final time for the start of a sentimental journey into history. 24 seconds into the flight, roll program complete. Atlantis now heads down, wings level on the proper alignment for its eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Four and a half million pounds of hardware and humans taking aim on the International Space Station.